plants, did you see the bee? It was right inside the flower, which means if there was a female flower open, and it would get, if it would get to the female flower, it would have pollinated the flower. So the bee, <laughs> I scared the bee away. <laughs> Forgive me. <laughs> oh. It was inside here. Can you see the pollen? So there's no female open, only male flowers here. I hope there'll be a female soon. I think I should harvest another male flower because it's been two days for the, our the, the flower in the fridge. There's a female here. Here, a female. Oh my, because this is a male closing up. This one that is about to open here, another one here is a male. Only one female there. So the males are so many, <laughs> the females are few. Only in the plant kingdom. <laughs> Okay, friends, let me go and check uh, our male flower in the fridge so we can see. Look, there's a bee. There's a bee. There's a bee. A bee. A bee. See? See? The bee. This is perfect. I got it. So if there was a female flower open, definitely it would get pollinated if the bee would get to the female flower. Oh, here, very busy. It has come back. <laughs> Thank you for forgiving me, <laughs> chasing the bee away. See? But the issue is that both are male flowers, so... There's no pollination going on. See, see the way it's rubbing itself on the pollen. It's rubbing itself on the pollen. Look. I hope I'm not too loud. I don't distract you. See. It has come to this other flower. See. Mm -hmm. Rubbing itself on the pollen. It has gone back to the two flowers, rubbing itself on the pollen. So this is the natural process of pollination. Only if there was a female open, but no. <laughs> oh, these are males. Sorry, B. A lot of hard work, but all oh, these are male flowers. <laughs> oh, these are male flowers. Oh, see the hard work the bee is doing. See, it has gone to the third zucchini now. It's on the third zucchini. See? It's on the third zucchini. There it is. Getting pollen, getting pollen, getting pollen. So if there was a female open, I'm whispering. I'm whispering. <laughs> oh, a 
lot of hard work. Oh my, Mr. B, a lot of hard work. And there's no female, no female open. Oh my. Look, look, look closely. See, see? Getting pollen. It's getting pollen. It's right inside. Going round, just getting pollen onto its body, to the wings. You climb out and go to another flower. Where is it? Where is it? Oops, I lost it. There. Where is it? I lost it, but it's somewhere inside here. Oh, gone. Sorry, bee. The bee has come back. The bee has come back. It's working so hard. Let's come back again. Working so hard. Look. It's rubbing off almost all of the pollen. <laughs> and there's no female open. See, hard at work, hard at work. See? These are the wonders of creation. Trying to get as close as I can. See, see, it goes round. So the pollen is rubbing on it onto its body, the wings. Then it flies off elsewhere. I lost it. I can hear the sound, but I don't know where it has gone to. I lost it somewhere. I lost it. There, it's back. So far it has visited that flower, it has visited this one, it has also come to this one. So it has visited all the flowers, meaning if there was a female open, today was the day. And it has rubbed so much pollen on its body. Look. Ooh. Private. <laughs> I need to get out of here. <laughs> I got the male flower that we sent uh, here. It was in the fridge. Still looking good, although I've not opened inside to know how the pollen is. Because I don't want to touch it till we can hand pollinate. So I'm thinking of harvesting another male flower, but since the bees are so busy right now, <laughs> there's no female. I'm going to leave them. I'm going to leave all the flowers intact. I won't harvest any now. 
I'll give it some time. I'll come later. If I see it's about to close up, I'll just get it because once it closes up, it will be closed. It won't open again. Because looking from the other days, the ones that closed up, see? They are still closed. You see? The ones we've been monitoring from day one, they remained closed. So I'm going to harvest another male later. Because, I mean, we need some zucchinis. All this, look at this beautiful plant. We need fruit from this beautiful plants. Look at this. The leaves are so healthy, so nice. Looking so good. So my task is to hunt for the nets. It's half past 11 in the morning and I came to check whether there are any changes in the zucchini. So the sun has gotten to this part of the garden. So look at the flowers that were open in the morning. And guess what? This female now is about to open. See this one? Look at this. It's, the top part is starting to turn yellow, which means it's about to open. See? The ones that were open in the morning where we are looking at the bees, they are closed. Look at this. Closed again. This is our famous flower. Look at this. They are closing themselves. I'm going to harvest. I need to harvest a male. I've harvested a male from there already. I want to harvest one male from here. This one. Take it to the fridge. So tomorrow morning, I have hope. Tomorrow morning I have hope there will be a female. See this? Tomorrow morning we are getting a female. <laughs> so, I'm going to take one male from here. I'll take one male from here because this is also going to be a male. This is going to be a male and it's going to open up tomorrow. So, Let's take one male from here in case the one in the fridge. Yeah. So this I'm going to take to the fridge. Tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning we are rushing. <laughs> to do some hand pollination. We're drilling it's going to be open. I just walked to the garden and this is what I found.